English and I'm joined with the guys from Massive. I have Ben and I have Brad. If you just want to introduce yourselves and just tell me you're rolling about. Hello, I'm Brad. And I'm the front man, the, the charismatic, um, good looking fellow out front. So I'm the van driver usually. I'm the leader, the fearless leader. And it's really just an all round good guy. I'm Ben and I'm a better guy. And I play guitar. Short and sweet. <laughs> so, um, for people that are familiar with your band, um, you guys are actually originally from Australia. Um, I believe that you're not all based in Australia now, but you sort of managed to sort of get together as a band. Um, so, you're living in Germany? Yeah. That's correct, yeah? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Ben, ben lives wherever he can find a place to stay. Look here now. You live here yeah. now. Yeah. Well, you live. You guys are like living here now for like the um, next sort of two months. Two months, aren't you? Because you've got quite an extensive tour going through the UK, and which is also including playing some excellent festivals like SOS Festival today. Yeah. And you're also down on the map to play um, Stone Death Festival. So what? Yeah. Yeah. Good fun, that yeah. One. So how's it been going this tour? I mean, obviously, I've heard about the um, trouble you've had to sort of with your accommodation and stuff. Yeah, it's yeah. just it's just just the two of blues, you know. The, uh, the 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 rock and roll stories happen later in the tour. These are just annoying things that happen at the start of the tour. When we we want to be professional and we rock up, and our accommodation doesn't exist, which is a good way to start the tour. I nice sleep in the van, nice getting to know each other again. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. Apart from that, um, we're only at the beginning of our tour, so the last one's not to a report yet. <laughs> last um, week, last time we rocked the Underworld in London, it was yeah. pretty cool. Um, it was a great turnout. Yeah, it was, it was good. And uh, we're up to Edinburgh on Tuesday. Clash with the kiss. Mm. It's alright. We, we're, we're younger. And we're better. You're better. We're better than kiss. Yeah. Than You've got more to one back. We, we're, we've got youth on our side, just, but... Yeah, just. <laughs> only about ten years old. Of this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but you, you've got like a beer drinking, rock and roll, wrecking crew reputation to maintain. Yeah. 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 Well, I mean, we we are not scared. We go up against anybody. Yeah. We just go out there and do our thing, and people like us or they don't. And if yeah. they don't like us, they're fucking scared. <laughs> <Really cool. laughs> well, I'm looking forward to seeing you guys later on. Um, so on this, so I've heard that you've um, signed to off your record, no, off your off your record. Um, so does that mean we're going to see more of you in the UK? Yeah, we love the UK. <coughs> we come here every year. This yeah. is what, sixth tour. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, our third album. So off your rocker, we've known off your rocker for years. Um, and the thing with off your rocker is they're rock and roll bands. Oh, yeah. And you know, when it came to looking for a new label, we didn't we didn't want. A business guy going, I can sell you this, I can make this happen. Like, we don't need false promises, we've had them in our whole lives. So we just want to drop bands that wanted to work with us. Yeah. So, and yeah, after all, came around, it's good. So that's working out, so that's fantastic. So, yeah. Yeah. Now you just want to make a noise. <laughs> that's how he burps. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, within the band, sort of, who's the creative boss and who writes the lyrics and music? Mostly, yeah, mostly Brad. I heard, yeah, I heard, I was picking a hair out of my mouth when you said it. Flossing. Yeah. Stuff out of my mouth. Yeah. Um, <laughs> so, creative force. Um, uh, we're, we're all musicians, we're all creative. I, I usually write the lyrics, then I write some lyrics. And, and uh, we're, not, we're not one of those bands that has like four equal heads going in, like, you know, going into a room. So that, that just causes that. It's like, yeah. It's better to have like a, a hierarchy of, you know, you know, me and Ben write and stuff together and you know, I, I usually write the lyrics and, you know, it doesn't, no one's precious about anything. I can, like, if everyone else says it's shit, can I say shit? Say like. Shit. Yeah. If everyone else says it's shit, then it's shit and we won't do it. But, yeah, um, it's, it's, and it's funny, like, you trigger off different things from, from each other. Mm -hmm. Like, sometimes I come up with one tiny little riff. And Brad will hear that and go, oh, I like that. And then he'll he'll write a whole song around one little little bit. And 
it's just it's something in his mind tr triggered it, triggered off something, and, and he went, I know what I need to do with it. Which is good, which is good. And yeah, yeah and then, then some of the stuff I, I write over the top of the things he writes, I would never have thought of, but he triggers off something in. Yeah, there was a there was a song on this album um, called Roses. It's probably a middle of the middle of the road kind of song when, when I wrote it, and I sent it to Ben as like a little garage band demo, and he took it and he just added like one little thing. He just added a halftime bit in the chorus, and it just turned that like song that probably was going to be track ten or eleven on the album, but made it for a single. Like it just there's little things that we add to each other's ideas yeah. that makes everything just better. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. This, we're all creative, but we, we feed off each other in different ways, I guess. So. Yeah. Okay, so How's that, kids? And a real <laughs> answer to a question for a change. <laughs> That's great. So we were talking earlier about you guys touring and obviously the, your adventures that you've had and having to bunk up in the band with each other. So who has the most annoying habits in the world? Uh, um, the other two guys. Yeah. Yeah. We are perfect. We are. It's, it's insane. <laughs> we don't let them talk anymore because they're so annoying. They don't even let them out of the band. They're going to get out of the band. They're, get out of the band. They're, they're chained up in the back right now because, man, if you saw those guys, you'd hate us. You'd think, oh, God, who are these idiots? But, um, yeah. No, um, yeah. What, what, I, yeah, what we just said. I'm a, <laughs> I'm, I'm the guy that gets angry at people for being late. Ben's always late. Uh, the other two, I don't like bagging people behind their backs, they're not here, so let's just say that you know, they're, they're faults, but we can't tell them off because they're not here. Yeah, so no, I, their... I must say, Green Tree doesn't have any faults, he's absolutely flawless. Yeah, so, it's sort of a little bit too flawless, isn't he? Yeah, it? he's yeah, always man. in the same mood, he's always. Maybe his fault he does is. His job. Maybe his fault is he's too flawless. Maybe he's yeah. like something. The other guy, Maybe. well, you know. Yeah. See. Give him, give him a couple of years and we'll see how he goes. <laughs> right, I'm going to ask you a totally round question. Um, as opposed to the other ones. As opposed to the other ones, they're yeah. All, they're yeah. all pretty standard. Uh, what's your favourite cheese, if you like cheese? Um, I like Jailsburg. Yeah, yeah, yeah I'll throw you Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now that we know Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Not to be confused with the drink Carlsberg. No, <laughs> very different to that. <laughs> Oh yeah, yeah, of course. We yeah, we thank everyone. 
this isn't an award ceremony. Yeah, no, no, it's, it's not an award ceremony. I, I just said it's so anything, else you, anything else you want to say or mention to, like, Paddy Mosh viewers? Oh, yeah, look, um, <laughs> don't, don't break the law, kids. Um, don't end up like us. <laughs> if there's anything you can do to change your future, yeah, don't well, end up well, like us. And if, if you love something, just go for it. Don't give up. Follow your dreams. Follow your dreams. Okay. Yeah, thank you guys for um, taking the time to answer my questions. So, thank yeah, you. rock on. Thank you. Cheers. Thanking you. <laughs>